Peloton rallied after agreeing to offer bikes and accessories on Amazon as part of its turnaround plan. Now, this is breaking with the longtime practice of selling products through its own channels. The move to open a U.S. storefront on Amazon's online marketplace should help Peloton expand its distribution and make products more readily available. Well, Google confirms a new attack that can read all Gmail messages. Google says an espionage threat group it says is backed by the Iranian government has a new tool that has been used to successfully hack a small number of Gmail accounts. It recommends not using weak passwords and, and also implementing two-factor verification on your Google account. And also, Salesforce gave a forecast for quarterly revenue that fell short of analyst estimates, suggesting that a choppy economy may be causing some customers to slow spending on business software. Salesforce is the leader in cloud-based customer management software and has a wide variety of clients across many industries. And smartphone makers are reporting big downturns in smartphone buying, and analysts think it's because people are holding on to their phones longer. But the market is still high for expensive phones. People are still buying those. Nearly every smartphone maker besides Samsung and Apple reported lower smartphone shipments in the second quarter. From the NASDAQ market site, I'm Jane King with your tech report.